collection of over 500 images that promise visitors an immersive experience shedding light on the rich history and evolution of Nairobi City. The gallery launched was officiated by the Principal Secretary for Culture, the Arts and Heritage, Umi Mohammed Bashir, at a ceremony attended by dozens of high-profile dignitaries, among them Nairobi County um, CCM for Inclusivity, Public Participation, as well as Public Service Dr. Anastasia Nyalita, who represented Nairobi Governor Johnson Sakaja. Our cultural heritage being part of it, and you see uh, culture is not static, it's evolving. So as a government, we strongly, strongly support creatives, and uh, the bottom-up transformative agenda is part and parcel of our plan, and uh, we advocate for that, and we encourage more and more art galleries where we involve the youths and the people at the bottom of the pyramid. We've uh, finally moved from the construction period, now we are in the leasing phase, especially on the office side, and as people are going through the gallery, the, region, the reason why we had different venues is that uh, we wanted people to see that GTC project is now coming to life. You've seen occupancy at the mall. We have a uh, Pili restaurant, we have Union. So, and then coming down, we have from on the retail side of the, of the office tower, we have different partners. We will go from sub-county to sub-county, scouting for talent, there will be competitions, the win, there will be winners announced on the, on the last day of the 17th of December. But beyond that also is that what platform we provide to capacity 